time, as we perceive it, may be an illusion rather than an intrinsic feature of the universe. Einstein's theory of relativity demonstrates that time is relative and intertwined with space, forming what we call space-time. In this framework, the past, present, and future are not separate but exist simultaneously in what's known as the block universe theory. Carlo Rovelli, in his book The Order of Time, furthers this idea, arguing that the flow of time is a construct of human cognition rather than an absolute property of reality. What we call time is a framework our consciousness uses to navigate the universe. This raises a profound question. If time is not fundamental but a subjective experience, what role does consciousness play in giving it structure and flow? Can the future influence the present? Retrocausality, a concept from quantum mechanics, challenges the conventional linear view of time by suggesting that future events can influence the present. This idea is vividly illustrated in Wheeler's delayed choice experiment where the act of observing a particle determines its state retroactively. Imagine a photon traveling through space. Whether it behaves as a wave or a particle depends on a choice made after it has already passed through a detector. This challenges our intuitive sense of cause and effect, suggesting a bi-directional relationship between time and events. Some physicists propose that consciousness, through its interaction with quantum systems, may play a role in collapsing the wave function, not just across space, but also across time. Could it be that our future decisions ripple backward into the present, shaping outcomes in ways we're only beginning to grasp? The human brain's perception of time is a key factor in understanding how consciousness interacts with it. Neuroscientific studies reveal that the brain synthesizes memories of the past and anticipations of the future into a continuous experience of the present. However, altered states of consciousness, induced by meditation, psychedelic substances, or near-death experiences, can disrupt this sense of temporal flow leading individuals to report a feeling of timelessness. Julian Barber's timeless physics aligns with this phenomenon, proposing that time is an emergent property created by the brain's ability to organize snapshots of reality. If consciousness indeed stitches together discrete moments into what we perceive as time, could it also manipulate the flow of time by altering its focus or state of awareness? Quantum theories of consciousness, such as Penrose and Hameroff's Ork-Or theory, suggest that quantum processes in the brain could interact with time at a fundamental level. Microtubules within neurons may harness quantum coherence, allowing for computations that defy classical temporal boundaries. Additionally, the thermodynamic arrow of time, which dictates that entropy always increases, may not be as rigid as once thought. In quantum systems, time-reversible behavior has been observed, raising the possibility that consciousness could influence this symmetry. For instance, some researchers speculate that the brain's quantum states might allow it to access information from both the past and the future, creating a bidirectional interplay between consciousness and time. While this remains speculative, it opens the door to a universe where time is less linear and more dynamic than we've imagined. If consciousness does shape time, the implications for science, philosophy, and humanity are staggering. A reality where consciousness influences time challenges deterministic views of the universe potentially reconciling free will with physical laws. Philosophically, it raises profound questions about the nature of existence and whether our decisions echo across past and future timelines. Practically, understanding the interplay between consciousness and time could revolutionize technology, 
enabling advancements in artificial intelligence, time-based decision-making, and even methods to manipulate time perception. Spiritually, this perspective resonates with teachings from mystics and sages across cultures who emphasize the importance of living in the eternal now. Whether we view time as an illusion or as a medium shaped by consciousness, one thing is clear. Exploring this frontier holds the potential to redefine our understanding of both the universe and ourselves.